So let me do my face. Um, I'm not even about to put on no promo because I just don't feel like it today. And I'm using the. Am I gonna use a beauty blender? Um, yeah, I'm gonna use a beauty blender for my foundation. And I'm using the Makeup Revolution concept. I mean foundation. Okay, guys, so now I'm about to go in with one of these setting powders. I'm not sure which one I want to use. Um, Let's try O. And I'm going to use Y, like, all over the rest of my face. Yes. They pop off? Do they screw? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, they pop off. So, no screw. They pop off. It comes with, like, a powder puff. So cute. I'm going to use this. Um, to set the rest of my face. I ain't gonna use that on the eyes. So I wanna show you guys what the shades look like. And I feel like you will find your shade because they have buku like different shades, buku colors. It's like seven of them. So there is a shade for you. It's gonna work. I think um they have shades dark and white. I think. Yeah. To me, why kind of reminds me of Laura Mercier, the a medium deep one, which I absolutely love. It's my jam. Okay, so this is how it comes out, like in the sifter. This is what it look like. This is what the shade look like. So I'm just going under the eyes and like getting the creases from under there. This powder is very yellow. What is here? I 
Okay, let's start with this bunch. Yeah, when I use powders like this, this like reminds me of like, um, like a banana powder or something like that. I just feel like when I get ready to dust this off, okay, it ain't gonna dust off how I'm expecting it to dust off. And I don't like bake or whatever, but this kind of goes on thick, like I ain't got no choice. <laughs> okay. Got it off. Now let me tap some in the cap. What, what I don't like that it don't screw. Because like when you put the cap upside down, like the powder presses down into it. I mean, that's not a big deal, but it's a, it's a big deal, I guess. <laughs> so now I'm going to take one of these little powder puff things. And this is what this shade looks like. The color. And I'm going to sit. And these setting powders are $20. That's cheap. Lord Mercy is about what, $40? With tax and everything, about $40. Okay. So, moment of truth. Let's go in and dust these powders on. Like, I like powders that are, like, not, like, too drying for me because, yeah. Let me go in with some more of this yellow powder just to, like, get closer to these areas. Because, basically, the yellow powder turns your, <laughs> your stuff yellow. If that makes any sense or whatever, it becomes yellow. Yeah, so, next time, I'm going to try it in. But in yellow too. So we'll see. We'll keep on working on it. Sometimes when you try something for the first time, it don't be exactly what you expect it to be. Like I feel like I need to go over this with this powder right here. Okay. So this is what our base is looking like. I feel like my nose kind of was so harsh. But I'm going to spray my face down with the Morphe uh, Prep and Set. Yeah. As I normally would. <laughs> You're running out. Routine for you guys probably in the next video. Um, yeah. So, yeah. This is what it, I'm looking like. A whole snack. Yes, yes, but okay, so I'll catch back up with you guys later, and yeah, do see. Okay, so I showed y'all all the colors of the powder, except for one. Let me show you the difference between these two yellow ones, because I feel like, girl, you need to know, so you can know what you're going to purchase. Um, and my makeup looks nice. It actually looks good. Um, this powder is more like a drying kind of powder. Like, if you want it to last long, probably. I don't know. Let me not say that because I don't know how long the makeup lasts with the powder. But, it's chalky. Or it's hard to dust away. Like, lately I've been using 
for comparison, I've been using the Huda Beauty um, setting powder, and that setting powder is like, it's not drying at all. It's literally doing what it say. It's just setting, and it's not like long lasting or nothing like that. Like the powder that I use is like a green yellow. This one is like a yellow yellow, kind of like the Huda. It look like Kunafa. So these are the difference. This is in. Let me make sure. Yeah, I'm with this one is O. So this is N and this is O. N, I mean O N on this side. So that's what they look like for a difference. Um, one is just more yellow than the other, or like it's a different tone of yellow. So when I say they have everything for everybody, like if you got an olivey like skin tone or undertone, like you might like this one or whatever, because it's like green yellow. I don't know. Um, hard to explain. But yeah, I feel like the packaging is okay. Um, it could have been a little better packaging, but who cares? Like it's a powder, you're gonna use it, it's gonna get messy or whatever. But yeah, it's kinda like the Lord Mercy itself, but it don't screw. I don't like that it snaps on or whatever. That is just not something that I enjoy. But overall, like the powder looks so nice. I have to work with it a little bit more, so I don't wanna say go out and buy it. It's just like a first impression or whatever of the powder. Um, but it look good. It really do. It look good on the skin, but my pores, I didn't put on any primer either, so I don't normally do that, so not let me not blame it on that, but I feel like my pores are like standing out a little bit more, like under my eyes, or maybe it's just dry right there. Like I said, my under eyes, my face is oily. I have oily combination skin. Like the rest of my face is oily, but under my eyes is like dry. Like that's the only place on my face at the end of the day that just be dry as hell, okay? Good. I don't know that's the only place but yeah overall i really like the powder i like the way it looks it's really pretty the color is not even bad especially why okay i'm feeling why 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 i'm really feeling why it's really nice um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button okay what are you doing sis hit that subscribe button and i'm gonna do like a updated foundation routine i'm not gonna show my foundation in this video because yeah i do it differently and i just really want to show you the products that i'm used to working with not anything new so yeah i'm gonna do a updated foundation